Welcome to Upskills for Work. Help build your skills for learning, work, and life. Communication. Understanding nonverbal communication. Communication is when you use sound, words, images, and movements to share your ideas and feelings with other people. Communication skills are important for work and life. We use communication skills to find and share information, connect with others, and express our feelings and needs. Communication often involves using and understanding words, but there are lots of ways to communicate without using words. This is called nonverbal communication. Alma is the new receptionist at a dental office. Her supervisor, Zara, tells Alma that part of her job includes making sure patients feel comfortable. Zara teaches Alma about three ways patients can communicate how they're feeling without saying a word. Zara tells Alma that one way to understand how a patient is feeling is by looking at their facial expression. Smiling and frowning are examples of facial expressions. Zara points out that the patient is smiling and their face is relaxed. Alma can see that this patient seems to be happy and comfortable. Zara tells Alma that people's body language can also give information about how a patient is feeling. Body language is how a person stands, sits, or holds their body. Zara points to a patient slumped over in his seat, gripping his jaw. Alma notices the patient's slouch and how he's holding his jaw. This patient looks uncomfortable. A third way to understand how a person is feeling is by paying attention to their tone of voice. Tone is the way you speak to someone. It's how your emotions come through your voice. Alma notices this patient is speaking very quickly and quietly. She thinks the patient sounds a bit nervous. Understanding nonverbal communication is a skill that you can get better at with practice. Pay attention to people's facial expressions, body language, and tone of voice to help develop your nonverbal communication skills. It's never too late to learn or improve the communication skills that are important to you. To create a plan to improve your learning skills for work and life, visit Upskills for Work dot ca